Yet, of course, the uh, radioactive poppy Danny Limelight. You guys have teamed together under many different names. The Bodega, 5150. You've won championships, as you said, all over the world. MLW, United Wrestling Network. You run them in Puerto Rico. Really, where haven't you won championships together? Is the I question. mean, if they... The Lucha scumbag making his way to the ring. I got to be honest with you, when Danny Limelight said he was going to be a part of the show here tonight, a lot of people were worried. No one wanted to get in the ring with your partner at your benefit show, but Chris Nasty said that this was his opportunity. This was a chance for him to get the biggest match of his career, and he wasn't going to let it slip by. He wanted this opportunity against Danny Limelight. Going for a slap in the face. This is not going to be a friendly competition, but hey, Chris Nasty showing some of those lucha skills he's known for. But that doesn't seem to slow down your boy Danny. He's uh, he's going right back for it. It seems like Danny's saying, if you like Chris Nasty, you guys can have him throwing him out of the ring. Really one of the strengths of Danny Limelight is the ability to beat you from so many different angles in so many different places. He sometimes gets known as a, a high flyer for some of the things he's done in like AEW, but he can wrestle on the ground. He can he can hit you with so many different types of offense. Getting those fingers in the face as we get another pin here. Yeah, I don't know if that was intentional or if maybe happenstance, but that's two big shots to the ribcage now that Danny Limelight suffered. Oh my goodness, and a tribute! A tribute to hey. the slice boogie from your guy! It works! Me gente, the Bodega 5150 standing strong! It works! 